Congratulations on your purchase of the Uricult Vet product. In this training, I'm going to show you just how easy it is to do a urine culture screen in your veterinary office using the Uricult Vet. The procedure is simple and requires only three steps. Inoculate, incubate, and read the results. First, let's get started by looking at the materials you'll need to perform the test. First, you'll need an incubator set at 36 plus or minus 2 degrees Celsius. Be sure that your incubator can hold that temperature throughout the entire time of the incubation period. If you're using the Cultura M incubator, like the one shown here, you can simply read the temperature through the door using the thermometer that's provided. Each line on the thermometer represents 10 degrees Celsius. Next, you'll need one Uricult Vet dip paddle for each test that is performed. And finally, the Uricult Vet slide guide or a wall chart will help you make an estimated colony count or preliminary identification when you're ready to read the results. Now that you're familiar with the materials needed to perform the test, let's talk about the test procedure. It is recommended that a veterinarian collect the sample using cystocentesis in order to reduce the chance of specimen contamination. Once the specimen is collected, inoculate immediately or mix the sample before inoculating. First, inspect the paddle carefully to make sure that there's no bacteria growth and no cracks in the media. Remove the paddle from the plastic vial and be very careful not to touch the media or to have it come in contact with any surfaces. Next, hold the syringe containing the specimen over the Uricult vet paddle and apply a few drops of urine to both sides of the paddle. Make sure that you completely coat both sides of the media. Then, place the paddle back into the plastic vial, but turn the cap only loosely to allow air to circulate. When you're done, be sure to label the vial appropriately using the label supplied in the kit. Place the paddle into the incubator and allow it to incubate for 16 to 24 hours. Make sure that the temperature of the incubator is 36 degrees plus or minus 2 degrees Celsius and that the door is shut tightly so that the incubator will maintain this temperature throughout the entire time of incubation. After the 16 to 24 hour incubation period, you are ready to read the results. Remove the Uricult vet paddle from the incubator. Remove the Uricult vet paddle from its plastic vial and inspect both sides of the media for bacterial growth. It is best to hold the paddle under a light when you're looking for bacterial growth and for colony characteristics. When there is no sign of bacteria growth and no color change on either side of the media, the Uricult vet paddle may be placed back into the incubator for an additional 24 hours to allow for the possibility of any slow growing bacteria to appear. If after 48 hours of incubation time, there is no sign of bacterial growth and still no color change on the paddle, the result is considered to be negative. If one or both sides of the media surfaces appear to have bacterial growth and the green side has turned toward blue or yellow, you can use the Uricult Vet slide guide, technical manual, wall chart, or package insert to make an estimated colony count and preliminary identification. First hold the paddle up to the colony density chart and match the number of colonies, they will resemble dots, that appear on the media surfaces with the printed example it most closely resembles. Check both sides of the media, but only report the highest colony count. Next, you should observe the previously green media for color changes. Compare the media color changes to the blue or yellow portion of the wall chart for interpretation. If you use the slide guide, set the black bar in the blue or yellow section that best describes the colony characteristics. View the orange area for your preliminary identification. Report your results. The Uricult vet paddle can now be discarded or, if necessary, it can be sent to a reference lab for confirmation and sensitivity studies. If you are going to ship it to a reference laboratory, screw the lid on tightly before shipping. Now that I've shown you how to use the Uricult vet system, let's take a few moments to review. Step 1. 
inoculate the paddle. Step two, incubate for 16 to 24 hours at 36 plus or minus two degrees Celsius. Negative cultures can be incubated for an additional 24 hours. Step three, read the results using the Euracult Vet slide guide, technical manual, package insert, or wall chart. You are now ready to start using the Euracult Vet product and to take your veterinary practice to the next level. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us. Thank you and have a great day.